So guys, this video is going to help every Windows 11 user because in this video, I'm going to show you how you can reduce the RAM usage while you are using your system. Like currently going to task manager and you can see it's using 62% RAM even it is in ideal condition. I'm not running anything here, just go into memory. This system has 4 GB and it is currently using 2.5 GB. If you use any other software or application, this is going to lag. That's why people saying Windows 11 very laggy and all that. And let me tell you if you are a gamer or normal user, you need to follow follow all the steps. After following the complete video, you will definitely going to thank me in comments because this is really helpful. Ok so let's see how you can reduce the RAM uses while gaming or doing any task and uh, make your system faster. Currently go into task manager again and now you can see here it is running Microsoft Edge, Microsoft Team, widgets taking around 109 or sometime it is take 200 also. So first thing if you are not using widget section, even you want to use you can just go to browser and search for news and all that right. So this is useless for low end system if you have good enough system and you are normal user you don't need to uninstall this if you are a gamer then you should also uninstall this because it is cutting down your fps in background so what you need to do just type here cmd run as administrator and yes and basically you just need to copy this command here it is going to uninstall this windows widgets you can again go into microsoft store and install it just type here y now we have successfully uninstalled the widgets. Now just go into taskbar setting and here you can see widget section is gone. Again now second app is like chat app. If you are not using team, even if you are using and you have low end system or even high end system, you can just go to web, right? So currently just turn off from here. So basically just go into start and type here teams and just right click on it and uninstall this. After that just go into startup apps and in startup apps you can see here Cortana is disabled, Microsoft team is enabled which I uninstalled. Microsoft Edge is also running whenever you turn on your system. So in background it is taking so much RAM inside your system. That's why 4GB PCs or laptops struggle while booting. So just disable all the startup apps. Next step is if you are not using OneDrive, don't use on your 4GB RAM because in background it is currently taking so much RAM and if you are playing game then definitely it is going to lower down your FPS right. Go into control panel, uninstall programs and just uninstall it. And if you want to use this Microsoft OneDrive, you can just go to web. So you don't need to install dedicated app for this because if you install this in background continuously it is syncing the files. Most of the time that takes so much RAM in system and some setting you need to change to lower down the RAM usage. So just go into settings, go into privacy and security. In privacy security just go into search permissions. So whenever you go here and you can see here search highlights. In background it is fetching the data from web using your internet as well and you can get the lower ping while gaming in background their service is running you need to stop these so your system will run faster so go into search permissions here you will see one setting like so search highlights turn it off and you can see you also remove this Bing chat so this is how you can cut down the processes lower down the RAM usage next setting is also in privacy and security just click on this journal and here you can see let's app show personalized ads by using my advertising ID if you turn on these four settings in background separate processes running for these settings right so turn off all these four settings from here again go into gaming section if you are not a gamer normal user you have low end system you want to use it smoothly just go into gaming mode and turn off this gaming mode another very important setting right here like going to graphics in graphics click on this change default graphics settings turn on this optimizations for windows game again go into update section it is showing me this update if you are a normal user and you usually do not update system regularly so what you can do just pause this update for a week so whenever you restart your system it is not going to check for update here so in background whenever it is checking for update it is taking so much RAM or bandwidth of your system and make your system slow if you are a regular user on my channel you already know what updates are coming so just go in here and resume update and update it again pause it so in background this process or service will not run now all settings are done here so whenever you fresh install this Windows 11 you get so many unwanted apps here like uh, Instagram ESPN, WhatsApp, Spotify, right click here and uninstall them. Another video editor app, if you are not using this, definitely most of the people not use this Clipchamp app. If you are using, you can just keep it, but if you are not using, just right click here, uninstall it. Next thing is you need to change the power plan settings. So what you need to do, just type here powercfg.cpl. 
if you see here high performance power plan so you can just check that and that's it so basically this will give high performance or high power to your component which is going to perform more faster some normal things you need to do like clean up your system clean up temporary files and all these things so let's do this type here temp and delete all these files from here again go press window plus r and type here percent temp percent select all delete again go and type here prefetch control all delete now type here ms config so basically this is a clean boot sometime what happens in daily life you use some software or applications so basically that time some services just uh, start up after that you don't need those services which is already running in background whenever you turn on your system so those services also start on a startup but you are not using them so basically you can use this way to turn off or cut down those services and get the better performance go into services and click on this checkbox like hide all microsoft services and just disable all so if you see some services which you want to stop so you can just check them and click here apply and ok and it will say you to restart so basically now you need to restart your system and after that I will show you some resources uses in background now we have restarted our system just go into task manager and go into processes and now you can see the memory uses is around 1.4 GB so this is how you can lower down the RAM uses you can see the CPU is also bring to normal and processes you can see 99 earlier it was around 127 or 130 right so we just cut down the processes and make your system more and more lighter now if you have 4 GB RAM you are free to use your system without lag